like do you like how I'm talking this way? I know. It's so madame madame. Hey guys, this is Heart and welcome to my skincare routine these days. So I just came back from Sorsoko and I was there for about three months. And now that, you know, with the quarantine and you have so much time for yourself, I've discovered a routine that I feel is best for me. So as you all know, I'm 35 years old and I just realized as you get older that there's just more time that you need to spend with yourself to really feel great and to really take care of you and for me aside from working out drinking lots of water and vitamins praying a lot as well meditating skincare is one of the best things that really uplifts my spirit it just instantly makes me feel good so we're going to begin this vlog with my favorite the very first would be dry brushing this is something that they've been doing in the ancient times. It's really, really good for your body. It says that it's really good for lymphatic drainage and just really helping you get rid of a lot of the toxins in your body. Preferably you do this in the morning, but sometimes I do this at night. Why in the morning? Because it helps your body create more energy, if that makes any sense. So if you drink coffee, dry brushing is also a good way to kickstart your day. Um, but sometimes I like to do it at night. It relaxes me, especially on my legs or my feet so you always have to start your dry brushing with this brush um, yeah I'm sure madami magi isik na parang pang labaga siya pwede din but no that's too harsh you have to find a brush that's very soft for those people that have sensitive skin I guess it's just common sense that you don't rub it too much but it's also very good to of course exfoliate your skin brighten your skin and there's some studies that say that it's good for cellulite reduction although that's not proven yet but um, it's really good to even out your skin tone or just again exfoliate and clean out your skin so I like to begin with putting lotion. You could put lotion or body oil. That's something that you can do. And you can just begin with brushing towards the heart. And this is really good. I find it really, really relaxing. And I've noticed my skin improved so much with this, especially because I've been under the sun like all day, every day. I mean, you eat out in the backyard, taking photos. Um, you just all the exposure is not really good so this is really nice and you know it's nice to just give extra care to the biggest organ in your body which is your skin there you could also do it for your underarms so it's also very very good so again it's towards the heart everything towards the heart but when you reach um, around your chest area it has to be like in a circular motion so this is super good. I love this. It feels so good. Skin is sensitive. You can do it like three times a day or two times a day or during the weekend. But it feels so good. Okay, so we're done with the dry brushing. I really love that. It's my new favorite thing. I've been doing it for probably over a month now. I still can't stop doing it. it feels so good and then next I would put my sunblock so before anything else before you do anything else to your face after my dry brushing I like to deep puff I got these cuties from glam pop queens on Instagram and I love doing this because I puff a lot I mean not everyone understands um, but I see it. I puff in my eyes, but this isn't really bad. My puffing today isn't bad. There are days that it's just really, really bad. So you like to put this in the freezer or in the ref. I like to put it in the freezer actually because it just feels so much better. And I do this when I have a lot of Maggie Sabor. <laughs> but you know what I mean? When you have a lot of salt and you have a lot of water retention, I react to water retention so much. So I love having this with me but it's so therapeutic i enjoy this i also love doing this when i'm watching tv i have a sensitive system i'm sensitive with my emotions and i'm sensitive with my skin i'm a sensitive i'm sensitive with my puffing and just a little salt i get really puffy 
Okay, so to cleanse my skin, you can do micellar water, which I always have. I have so much of micellar water, it removes my makeup. I also love to double cleanse because I have so much makeup on my face when I work. But if I don't do my micellar water, I am in love with this. I think I showed this in my other vlog. This is from my doctor, Dr. Ivy Teo. Um, this is a brightening C pad that I am obsessed with. It really does kind of even out your skin tone. And I just love it because it's instant. And I'll show you how dirty my skin is, even if I did double cleansing. It's kind of crazy. But just to show you how you really have to take care of your skin. And really clean it. And I do this on my neck. See, look at that. That's still a lot of makeup. I do this on my neck too. Um, to even out the skin tone. Um, as I got older, I started to develop a lot of melasma and freckles. I mean, I love my freckles though, but the melasma kind of bothers me. I don't know if you that's because of the sun. And this kind of evens it out. I also like to put it in my ears because I like it very even out. And you know, you could also put this on your elbows. You don't want to waste your products. And there's just so much product in the pad. Just This is just one pad, so you just don't want to waste it. All right, so next, um, people tend to forget about their sunblock. So, I mean, the question is, do you need to put sunblock while you're sleeping? Well, it depends if your windows are open, but if you have blinds, I think it's safe. But then, you know, I, I still like to put sunblock. It's a regimen or it's a routine that I want to get used to because you're always exposed to UVs like your phone, gadgets, and all of that. So I like to put sunblock on. Any kind of sunblock will do. But for extra, I know this is funny. I like to put gold leaf. Now I got this online and this was used during, again, the ancient times. They used gold leaf. Um, they mix it, you can mix it with oil, you could mix it with sunblock, you could mix it with your moisturizer, you can mix it with anything that you put on our serum. They use this in Japan. It is proven to have ions that are very, very good for your skin. And also, um, it's really good for anti-aging. Um, it really helps with the fine lines. So I like to put that on my face. Not all the time, but if ever I do it all the time, I like to put it on my neck. You can put it all the time on your face because again, consistency is key with everything. Especially at a certain age, you want to prevent. So gold leaf is also proven to prevent wrinkles. I also put a lot of my extra products on my hands because your hands and your neck show your real age. So here, I'm 35 because I need to pay more attention to my hands. But yeah, I love doing that. I think it's very important to do extra, extra care on your face because you don't want to regret that in the end. Okay, so we're going to go to the fun part of the vlog. I love going to Dr. Ivy. I love going to clinics. I do maintain my skin with machines because it's just it's available. Why not? So prevention is the best. Um, but I recently discovered through my sister actually. This is K Derma, and I'm working with them now, which is so amazing because I get a lot of products from my friends. Hopefully, we can do like a giveaway. Everything is all about LED lights. So it has different lights. This is the blue. This is red. Red, I know, is for collagen. When you reach the age of 25, like around 28 probably, I think you lose about 1% of your collagen every year. So that means you have more hollow cheeks or your eyes become deep set or you just look haggard. And you know, collagen has a lot to do with looking young and looking very youthful. So there are a lot of products and there are a lot of treatments and one is lead light. And it really helps with the penetration and the activation. With the vibration of this wand, it actually kind of boosts your collagen production. So I love this because I can take it anywhere. Um, I use the red or sometimes I like using the pink. This comes with an activating gel, but honestly, you could use it with anything. I, for example, use it with my anti-aging because you want everything to be anti-aging. So I like to use it. Um, you could use this every day, but it has to be five minutes long 
but if you use it just once a week which is realistic I think once a week although I do it every day um, once a week is also good because you like if you like how I'm talking this way um, once a week because you just have sometimes you're too busy to do this much I mean in a day or at night and you're just too tired so you could do it once a day for 30 minutes this is also good for lifting so I'm gonna put it like in the highest ever I'm gonna do red today so you have to do it in a motion that's going high and this is also good because it kind of helps penetrate the products into your face we're just gonna do this for 30 minutes I mean it's relaxing and you know if you don't have time to go to the derma or you're too afraid to step out of your house and you just want to do everything on your own I think this is a really really good investment to have I think it's a good idea for people to have their own products at home also this is my favorite actually I do this every night okay I lie I don't do this for five minutes I do it for ten minutes every night I don't know if that's bad but they said it was just for five minutes but technically it's five minutes five minutes five minutes five minutes you never forget your neck so again everything is towards up take time enjoy the process enjoy your time to yourself I love this. I love, love it. The next step, I love using a good serum. I think this is, aside from the sunblock, this is the first that you put on your skin. I know some people like to put it on their palm first, but I don't like wasting products, so I just put it straight on my skin. This is the one that you put first before all your cream because this is the one that gets Absorbed by your skin faster. I like to tap that in. Put all my eyelids, extra stuff on my eyelids. And I like to pat a little bit. Get the blood flowing. I put that on my neck as well. When you, when you put on your products you have to gently put it on don't forget the back of your neck because that matters too I know it's so madame madame but it helps of course never forget your eyes so I use a lot of eye cream um, but since I use a lot, I keep this in my makeup kit. I think I showed you guys this in my vlog in Sarsagon. Um, honestly, there are a lot of other products. I mean, machines that you could use for your eyes. Like there's Thermage, there's Ulthera. But I am just so afraid of putting that. It's like a blocker. It's like a gel. I don't know. It's like thick contact lens that you have to put. And I actually developed a cyst on the first layer, I don't know, the, like the clear film on my eye. So I'm scared of using any kind of anything to put on my eyes. Like I hate, I don't use contact lens, so I'm scared to put that thing. But some people are brave enough to do it because it's the only way to do Thermage, but I don't. So I just put a lot of anti-aging eye cream on my eyes every morning, every night, sometimes in the afternoon when I'm not doing anything. It's like putting hand cream, but of course you have to be very, very tender with your skin around the eyes. They are the most sensitive because they're like your neck. They are the ones to first go, so you have to make sure that you never neglect your neck and your eyes, your hands, your elbows, your knees and toes. Just kidding. I love this new mask. This is a lead mask. And I know you've seen this everywhere on Instagram, on everything, but what I love about this is that there's actually a little protection for the eyes. I get re migraines whenever I have a lot of like really strong lights. 
Um, this has like about seven lights, so there are different purposes. Again, my favorite one would be for collagen. And what's nice about this is that there is a timer. So when I put this on, it'll remind you it's super safe. Again, it'll protect your eyes and it just takes 10 minutes. So I use this every night before I sleep when I have all my products on my face already and then you want it to be really absorbed by um, your skin. I like to put this on top. So I'm going to show you how it works. And what I like about it is that it's really comfy. Guys, I'm not going to use the Okay, your Okay, so I'm going to press. Okay, consistent shot. So I'm going to press M. This is a different light. I think this is the green light. As you can see, this is the purple light. This is the yellow, what is it? Pink, blue, white, red. Again, I love the collagen and this is what I'm gonna do. And what's nice is I'm gonna wait, it's gonna tell me. And I'm not gonna keep you here for another 10 minutes. I'm gonna chill, I'm gonna relax. And this is my skin routine that I love doing. I hope you guys learned a little kaartehan for me. Oh, it was paused. Yes, thank you for telling me. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I truly did. If there's anything else that you are curious about or anything else that you would like to comment or any other questions that you have for me, you can comment down below. This has been Heart. Thank you so much. Good morning, good night, whatever it is. Don't forget, take care of your skin, take care of your soul, take care of yourself, love yourself, have self-worth, and everything else will be fine. Bye.